just wanted to share with you how to make a group purchase with people helping people worldwide. And uh, it's really simple. Um, so let's uh, get down to step one. Here's step one. Okay. And you know that, of course, you're going to put in the username, first name. Um, I'm going to do that right now. And it's going to drive uh, Julie crazy because uh, it'll show that someone wanted to register and then they bailed. But that's how it goes. I'll put in my username, Steph. That's my username. Yours might be Jim or Sally or Sue. So whatever the username is, put it there. My first name. My last name. My mobile. All right. My email. Um, use social tools. Plus sign. This is what you do on uh, Gmail if you want to create an unusual, different email alias. This is how you do it. The plus sign, and I'll just go testing at gmail.com. All right, and then choose a username. Um, my, if I was uh, registering, and it was the first time I was registering, uh, let's say the username up here was uh, Carlin, that's my wife, and I was going to register, then I would put Steph for my username down here. And then you click here to join, um, and you're in. Okay? Now, I'm not going to join because I don't want to register and, and then have... A, you know, Julie will have to delete me and it will create problems for her. But that's how you join. It's that simple. Click here to join now and you're done. And now we have to make a purchase. Now, remember, this video is about making a group purchase, a group purchase. In other words, more than one person. Let's say you were going to buy four. Uh, you were going to pay for four positions for somebody. Uh, I would click on uh, here to purchase. So you register first, and then you're going to register, as a reminder, you're going to register all your people first. So let's say you you do uh, the first person, we'll call them number one, the second, number two, three, and four. You're going to register four people, as an example. You would register them in step one first. Then you're going to come over here to make a purchase, and you're going to do four, because we're going to buy for four people. And you'd say add to cart. And then that's going to go into the cart. And then we're going to view the cart right here. View cart. Got to wait a minute. Takes time for things to load up and for databases to talk to one another. So here you see uh, I've got four selected it's fifty dollars can be 200 bucks and then with the handling fee of 1430 it's going to be 214 and 30 cents um so we see how to do that part okay now we're going to proceed to checkout now remember um we're doing it this way because you're going to use your credit card uh and Credit card companies sometimes get suspicious when you do the same purchase without uh, enough time expiring before purchases, and they may flag it as a as a bad purchase, and uh, we don't want that to happen. So we're buying four uh, Financial Freedom Series uh, fifty dollar. Uh, per unit, that's uh, $200, 214 and 30 cents. And now we're going to proceed to checkout right there. Proceed to checkout. And here we go. Now, 
this is what's important. You're going to put your name here. All your contact information is going to go here. You're going to select your credit card. Remember, with PayPal, you don't have to have a PayPal account to pay with credit card. Um, if you want to do Bitcoin, you'd select this. If you want to pay by cash, uh, uh, money order, or check, you would select this right in here. But let's assume you want to pay with credit card. You're going to select PayPal. And then right below, when you get to PayPal uh, checkout, right below there, it says to pay uh, with credit card uh, having no PayPal account. Okay, so an additional information right here. This is right here. This is the important area, this note section. Uh, order notes. So you would type in, let's say, uh, group purchase. Okay, and uh, I'm going to expand this so I can see what I'm typing. Pretty cool, isn't it? Group purchase, and I'm going to say Stefan. Okay. And uh, let's say my username, because remember, I had to register first, right? Stefan, um, username, uh, Steph. Okay. And I'll put the date in here, too. That might be very helpful. Uh, purchase is Dece uh, February 23rd. So I'll go uh, 02-23-2018. Group purchase. There's the date. They'll be able to find me that way. Stefan, username. And, you know, I'm going to bring my username up here. And I would go like this. This is what I would do. Put a pipe in there and then go username Steph. Then I would go, uh, that's my first person that I put in. So they're going to go position one, let's say. Then uh, two, Carlin as an example. Put in the pipe. The pipe, by the way, is shift and above the enter key to the right, you'll see a uh, a forward slash or a backslash sorry and right above it if you hit the shift key that's your pipe so you put in the pipe user name and it might be Carlin number three uh, Dave pipe username Dave Dave L. Okay. And the last number four, because we're buying four, would be Sue. Uh, and, uh, you know, I should put the last name in there. Sue, Sue. Right. Dave L. Carlin R. And I'm not, these are real people. Mine I could put in here. So I'm just abbreviating their last names for you. So that's what it would look like. Stefan McCarroll, username right there. Carlin R, username right there. Dave L, username right there. Susu, uh, pipe, username. And it'd be Sue R. Okay? So I fill all this out here, right? Billing details, all this stuff here. Fill it all out. Check out. Proceed to PayPal. Check out. And uh, you're done. And uh, Julie will get this information here. And she'll know you want to make a group purchase on February 23rd, uh, the year 2018. You made the purchase for Stephen McCarroll. There's his username. Carlin R, her username, Dave L, his username, Susu, and her username, and Julie will be able to find everybody that was registered and she'll be able to make sure their account shows up as paid and she'll place them right there in the matrix. Uh, 
in those uh, positions, one, two, three, and four. Now, if you've got somewhere you want them to go and it's an open spot, tell Julie where you would like them. Right there. Just type it out. Be specific. Make it clear. Make it detailed. Because remember, she doesn't know what's in your head. So you got to really spell it out for her so there is no misunderstandings, okay? And that's how you do a group purchase. Got any questions? You know where to find me. Stefan at uh, use social tools at gmail.com. That's how you find me, right there. Stefan at use social tools at gmail.com. Talk again on another People Helping People Worldwide video. Bye for now.